Assalamualaikum. Welcome to a big news. I'm listening to the headlines of the news. 100 firewood cutters cut army in Butida. Six arrested from Yarnangata Vice Joint Forces in Nodemondo, 22 August 2017. Now into the details. Butida. At least 100 Rohingya fire, wood and bamboo cutters were cut by army of battalion by 152 under Putidan Township while they were going to forest on 21 August 2017. Search site. They were taken to battalion by 152 and tortured by army severely in the custody. Among the victims, some of them were female members who are mostly widowers and girls. When the relatives of some victims went to the battalion with their family cards and shot them to army, some of the women, including girls and boys, were realized. But most of the victims are still confined at the custody where they have been tortured severely by army personnel. The army is demanding huge amount of money from the victims for their realize, but the relatives of the victims are unable to manage the demanded amount of money to pay to the military for realize of the victims. The victims are all members of poor families who go to forests and collect firewood and sell them in the market for money to support their families. In the meanwhile, the army cut them while they were going to forest for firewood and demanding huge amount of money which is difficult for the families to collect in their fateful days. As the families of the victims are unable to pay the demanded money to army, the victims are still confined at the custody where they are being tortured mercilessly search said. Due to just mistreatment and harassment of Myanmar security forces, the Rohingya Muslims are facing various crises including acute food crisis to survive, said a villager who declined to be named. At least six innocent Rohingya civilians were arrested by Burmese joint forces of military and border guard police BGP from Yernangata village tracked under sector to Mando, North on 21 August 2017. Search said on 21 August at around 1 p.m. about 100 joint forces of army and PGP from Camp 5 under sector to surround the Yernangata village and reportedly arrested six innocent Rohingya residents from the village. The victims were identified as Molabi Hamid Hussein, 40, son of Muhammad, Rashid Ahmad, 45, son of Muhammad Nasim, Kamal Hussein, 50, son of Muhammad, Ishak Ahmad, 27, son of Nur Muhammad, Samira's daughter of Abdul Nabi and Dildar, son of Guramiya of Yenangata village. The victims were taken to BGP camp and tortured them in their custody, climbing the link of the detainees with the Arkan Rohingya's Salvation Army ARSA. The six arrestees were severely and discriminately tortured in the police custody for confession of their link with the rebels, but they did not confess in, since they don't know about that at all. Sars Farta said the six detained persons are the daily workers for which who somehow support their families with their little income. Among the six victims, there is a woman who was also beaten up by army whose physical condition is stated to be bad. The villagers are also in trivial situation following the continuous raid of joint forces who are bitterly arrest people and torture severely, said a resident. The fate of the victim is unknown if they have been released or confined at the custody of BGP. Thank you for listening to News. Allah Hafiz.